Hi guys, I'm Ed. I'm Harry. It's February 5th. That means it's our birthday! Yay! Yes, today Game Walk is officially one year old. Thank you so much to everyone that's watched the channel, whether it just be one video or everything we do. We appreciate the support so very much and we'd be nothing without you guys. We would be absolutely nothing without you guys. In fact, YouTube's telling us to grow our audience. Thanks a lot, YouTube. Thanks for rubbing in the fact that we've dropped below 10k. So what we're going to be doing is reviewing our channel. Because what else do you do after you've been doing YouTube for a year, I suppose. So our first video was the channel trailer. It I was. Okay, let's check that out. Oh god. Oh god. Look how thin I was. Look how fat I was. Staring down the barrel of the lens, I don't even care. Is our camera on an angle? <laughs> I don't know. It looks horrific. We didn't stick to that schedule at all. We did not. In it's fact, quite <laughs> quick after this video, we stopped that schedule. It looks very drab as well, very dark and... Bizies? And... That's a bit different. <laughs> Jesus. Oh god, so the first videos we did were like ones I did in my bedroom. Yeah, yeah, we did the other Google Cardboard one and uh, our top 10 list, I forgot about those. Shit, I forgot about top 10 list. This is the first one we ever did. Oh well. god, the old intro, I forgot about that. We yeah, had yeah. Jan Animations redo it about six months ago. Oh god. <laughs> what? Nice, like that we're being, um... We're saying we think, so in case we'll get upset and comment things. Uh, that went out the window very quickly. Yep. What do you think is number one? I can't remember. Let's find out. Ocarina of Time? Ocarina of Time changed the world. I, we, I, <sighs> yeah. Hang on, gotta scroll all the way back down because you can't arrange it. So we kind of just did Let's Plays for a while, just more top yeah. fives. Mobile games. Uh, your Paper Mario is dead. Yes, this was like one of our first biggest successes. It was. It was released when Color Splash was announced. And I did it at the same time that Arlo did his. He's gone on to be phenomenally successful. Yeah, massively. Me, not so much. <laughs> but I mean, look at that. It's in 50 frames per second, that's weird. It just looks strange, doesn't it? I know, right? And the game was just as disappointing as it looks right now. Uh, that was good fun. Super all the VR hot. stuff we used to do. That was, um, God. when it first came out, we were all very excited about it, and it turned out to be. Bit of a letdown. Indeed. Oh, uh, when we gave away stuff in a vain attempt to get more subscribers. Oh god, I remember people really, really hating us for this because we decided to hide something. What was it? We did we an hid, Easter egg challenge or something. We hid an Easter egg in one of the top ten lists. I forget which one. So do I. Oh, I need to stop fucking clicking on it because you can't arrange them by date! Fuck, we got a lot of videos. Mobile Games of the Week, I remember that, that was good fun. Shit, Mobile Game of the Week. Those Always. were like a last minute thing we used to throw together on like a Friday. Yeah. And no one watched it. No. I 67 it. views. Yeah. This is pathetic. Dark Souls, that was, you know, I enjoyed our Dark Souls series. It was a good, lot of good chat in that it's one. It's our longest running series yeah. because it has 12 episodes in it. <laughs> vain Glory. Oh God, the, the road, road to Vain, vain Glory. glory. It was a good experiment, but I mean, it was a lot harder than we thought it would be. That was a great um, attempt. Like, I really yeah. enjoyed doing the trailer. The trailer, for I it. mean, look at it. I mean. And when we did this, I just thought, this, I'm sure we'll be fine. Wait. Oh, God. I remember doing yeah. this. This was such a fun day of filming that as well. Great. And we got to show this off at Comic-Con uh, for our first ever panel. Yeah, it was good. This fun. was so exciting. It's a shame that the series kind of stopped happening. I mean, it was very, it was very hard to do because. You know, even with the support of the guys we contacted, it just wouldn't have been possible. No, I mean, we basically had this really grandiose idea for how the final episode was going to be, and you're right, it just logistically was too difficult. <laughs> I mean, never say never. True, true. Not too late. It might be the hallowed final episode, like Half-Life 3. Yeah. You fell off the bike during it's, it's, this! It's at the end, isn't it? It's it is, yeah, there. hang on, we've, we've got to see the outtake. Because yeah. we borrowed a bike from one of our friends in the office, and it was such a hard bike Here we go, ride. here we go. And, and down! Oh my god! That hurt like hell. It looked like it hurt, and told Joe all he could do is snigger. Yeah, well, I don't blame him really. <laughs> You're right. So, what has been your highlight of the past year? If you could pick one game that we played or one experience that happened, what would be your favourite thing? That's really tough. In mm. terms of experiences, I think going to our first ever Comic Con, which I believe mm. we're about to hit some of the vlogs of that. The first ever Comic Con and our first ever mm. comedy sketches that involved us doing like the Pokemon Go stuff, the oh. Pokemon Go in real life up here. That was one of my favorites. They were so much fun to do. I mean, you know, running around King's Cross Station dressed as Pikachu with armed police ready to shoot me. That was. That was fun. That was nuts. <laughs> that was, yeah. But also, E3. Fucking E3. We E3, for, for two humble nerds such as ourselves, yeah. that was... A dream. A dream. A dream come true. Dream That's the dream. only way of putting it. And we met such amazing people while we were in LA. Yeah. Made friends for life. It was brilliant. And it's 
it's just, I, I can't wait to go back. I'm so excited to Look, go all back. All these games are about to come out. I mean, Happy Few, that was embarrassing. Farpoint, not yet. See, Happy, Happy Few actually is fine. It's just we struggled really we, badly we with did. it. But yeah, look, Sea of Thieves, yeah, stuff, well. Final Fantasy 15, yeah. that's here. Uh, Horizon Zero Dawn's yeah. coming out in a couple of months. Breath of the Wild is on the horizon. Yeah. And then not the Horizon Zero Dawn. I also noticed that the Loot Crate unboxings, I forgot we did these. And we just, we tried to do a different format each time, but we just, we couldn't think of them because they're so dull. Well, everyone does 15 minute unboxings yeah. of a six item box. Look at that one, the, the 40 second unboxing. Which one was that fastest yeah. unboxing ever? We tick? Go. With a tick. What an intro! <laughs> They had to recall those, they were too dangerous. Oh yeah, I remember that. And they're still just as disappointing as that. Yeah, I mean, really nothing's changed. Oh shit, left the annotations off. Uh-oh. Never mind. Think of all the views we could have lost there! I did it again! Ah. The YouTube purge. I love that we put expose and explain. We didn't really explain anything, we just speculated wildly. Indeed, for a <laughs> minute and 12 seconds. Yeah. So we didn't really know what we were doing, but views, that though. was... That was a real problem for our channel. How many did we lose? 800 subscribers? Yeah, about that. We were only at just sort of 2,200, weren't we? Yeah, we about were just that. about to hit 2,000 and we suddenly Almost slumped back low. So that was yeah. that was really crushing for us. But we, we managed to rise above that. <laughs> Brexit Luke unboxing, that was fun. Oh, when God. Brexit happened. Political, yeah, up to date, yeah. current. There's the Pikachu video. That yeah. was, let's watch a bit of that. This is, this is probably our button. proudest achievement. I didn't do the middle button again, did I? Oh. I got so ill, just running this thing is so hot, I'm a massive migraine. And it was the dead of summer as well, so look how many, hot it is. So many tourists taking photos and stopping me and See, stuff. everyone's like, you run like a, like a weirdo in this. It's like, yeah, because I'm having to run after you who can't run and you can't see where you're going. <laughs> right. I had to leave enough gaps so it looked like we were running, but then it just makes me look like I'm going... Yeah. I wish it got more views like this. It got quite a lot, but I mean, I wish- 28,000 views? That's a pretty decent sum. Could have gone viral though. This, I remember this. So I ran into the guy. I didn't see, I couldn't see a damn thing. And I was getting up and the woman kicks me when I'm down. Watch this, look, look. Ready? And boom. Kicks me. Tackles you. And I fall over again. What a bitch. People are mean. Oh, this is when we moved. I remember that. This is pimp my ride, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> look at the annotation. You have to be crazy. Like for the new intro. <laughs> That already looks massively different. Yeah, I think it looks a lot better now. I think so. We decided to get rid of 14-year-old bedroom chic, and now all those yeah. posters are now where that wall is. Oh look, um, nostalgia goals. Um, is it still good? Um, yeah. It was, I really wish this series would work, but we just couldn't get it quite right. Just playing the games <sighs> took too long. It did. And Getting it set up, and we wanted to yeah. do nice-looking intro shots, and basically that just never worked. And maybe we'll bring it back mm. if people want it enough, but so far no one seems to. Fan week? That was great. Of course, fan week can embrace, embrace your geek week. No, that was great fun. I really that enjoyed was. that. That um, was one of my favourite things to do, and that ended with the 24-hour livestream, didn't 24 it? 24-hour livestream, and that, was, that to me was the highlight of this last year, because I had such a good time, and so many people stuck around for the whole thing, and we raised... £750 for charity, and it was a great charity as well. Yeah, Young Minds, um, they do wonderful work with young do. people, so even if we're not doing a charity event yeah. to support them, please do try and support Young Minds, because they do great work. MCM October, I... That was such good fun. Again. It's always great fun. It's I'm honestly so excited. Every day I keep nudging Harry going, have they opened the booking for MCM yet? Because I really just want to get it in, yeah. get it locked down. Apparently they're moving a lot of stuff around this year. They always do, they always change it up, so that'd be good. Um, I'll look at our political stuff. Oh, of course, yes. Say Trump. Our first visit to the YouTube space as well. Can't and, do that anymore. And our last for the moment. One Night Stand, there it is. There this it is. Was, this was actually my favourite game of the last year. Um, I just loved it to bits. It was just so simple, so perfect. Um, this game by Lucy Blundell, it's just the... It's the most perfect thing I think we've ever played in terms of a visual novel story mm. game that's short, simple, and actually attaches yeah. you to every single thing that goes on. But, I mean, this yeah. game was... Perfect. Mm. I think it's probably one of the only ways of describing it. And Lucy, Kinmoku87, whose Twitter will be down in the description, she was very encouraging of us playing mm. her game. I think she's just happy to see that people enjoy her creation. And not only did we just enjoy playing it, we adored it. We I did. bought it at home and I was playing it there. It's just great and I'm really glad that we got the opportunity to play this. Dishonored as well. I forgot about Dishonored. Now, this was one of the most Googled things on Earth when mm. this came out. So we decided, fuck it, let's play. 794 views, 234 views, 258 views, 166 views, 
This is why we don't do multi-part series anymore. Mm. It absolutely murders our channel. People like seeing the first episode, and then they don't care about the story anymore. Mm. You might notice that recently we started adding in multiple part series like Choices, Kingdom, stuff like that where we come back and carry on what's been happening. And we've been enjoying doing those and spreading those out over time. And if you guys do want to see more multi-part series, like what we have with Dishonored, like what we have with Dark Souls, let us know, because I really enjoy watching like Spammels, for instance. And Spammels does a lot of his multi-part series, and they're very engaging. So if you guys have any games that you'd like to recommend to us, let us know. Actually, I just mentioned Spammels just a minute ago, and actually I feel that one thing that I should say with regards to our first year of YouTube is all the friends and creator friends that we've made mm. just by doing this, just by chatting yeah. to other people and finding other creators. Spammels and I end up speaking, I mean, it went from just a kind of chat about the stuff we make, but I now speak to Spammels every day, and it's it's really blossomed into a wonderful friendship, and I love that it's come from this. Just from making stupid videos about who said it, Kanye or Trump. It's just blossomed that. into this huge world where people love watching what we do, we love making what we do. It's just fun. I love doing yeah, this. It's been brilliant. Uh, Pokemon Go is dead. We were so proud of this one. It's really hard to operate the suit, by the way. Uh, that was amazing. Oh me. my god, we didn't add in the bit that happened after that. So after those dogs chased Harry, her, the owner of those dogs runs after them. This one here stops. She plummets over the top of him and smashes onto the pavement. Shouldn't have been funny, but I pissed myself. Harry couldn't see it because he was trying no. to run away from no. genuinely crazed dogs. Yeah, they were really, they didn't like me at all. They did not. No. Ah, the PewDiePie deletes his channel at 50 million. That was only a month ago, but look how many fucking views that got just from the fucking title. And I still feel bad about that because that was like the biggest click baby ever did, but it did get lots of views. It so. did, and then we got a pretty similar amount of views on the actual live stream, yeah. so... We're assholes, And then last we did all Guardian? these Spammels collabs as well. Last Guardian yeah. as well. So I was going to say, Last Guardian was um, the biggest letdown of the last year, I thought. Um, it was just boring. We got, yeah. we, we played it and just went, should we carry on? And I just went, no. Let's just put this out. And if people watch it, we'll do more. And no one did. Spammels, the final. Now, this was uh, one of my favorite collabs to do mm. because this was so mental. But basically, in the end, it was the Game Hog boys who won. Let's just see the moment where we realize we won. There it is. There it is. Oh, that was so much fun. Now, now as I recall, Spammels was supposed to do some kind of video telling us how good we are. He hasn't done that yet, has he? No, he hasn't. Our Christmas special. There it was. Now, I'd argue that this is the video at, at least I'm most proud of. I think we, this was written so well by our friend Drew. Yeah. And we, we just had so much fun making this. It was such yeah. a long few days. Yeah. And actually this took 36 hours of straight editing. Yeah, straight away. Just the, all the effects, all the editing together. That was a nightmare. I'd never been so delirious after I left. The makeup needed for the ghost of the future was insane. I was in the makeup chair for like an hour and a half, two hours. Oh God, yeah, this guy here. See, this yeah, was, um... There he is. I'm so pleased with this. Like, it's a shame it only got 600... 600 views! Was it? It's a nine-minute video that took us days of our lives! It's really good quality. The production values are fairly decent for a small YouTube channel who work out of a crap little studio in an office, and yeah. none of you watched it! No, they all watched it. it was, you all watched it. No one else did. People didn't watch yeah. it. Yeah. Assassin's Creed. Creed. Bit of a letdown. Jesus, not even a bit of a letdown, just terrible. Oh god, and then we did the Rocky things, these were fun. We actually did this in the midst of getting everything done for the Christmas Carol. We had to do all of these in the yeah. same week. Which is why there's still tinsel up in January. <laughs> That's a great point. <laughs> yeah, like, so this was this was another day that was just great fun to film. So I remember I was trying to sort out the uh, boxing gym's dirty in, and they said they could film there, but they never got back to me, so we just had to turn up on the day and just figure out how to do it. Um, yeah, it was crazy. We had like a massive, a group of like hard men ready to be boxing, standing outside and we were just sort of- Yeah, like, oh, here. sorry. I should mention that my nipples could have cut through the fucking walls it during this. Cold. It was fucking cold. And you guys just turned to me and went, so you're going to do it without a shirt? <laughs> okay, why? What's well, been a fun year? What's been your standout moment, standout game? If you could pick one thing, just one thing. Ooh, okay, so if I'm going to go for standout moment, It'll probably be meeting the Game Grumps at E3, just because all of that in one bundle was just too much for me to handle. Yeah. Favorite game. It's tough because I really want to pick choices. 
Really? I've had like I know it's not a good game, but I've had so much fun doing that and just making stupid voices. Oh. But I don't know. It's probably probably one night stand to be honest. Yeah, I mean, yeah, I mean, the fun is what it's all about, isn't it? Really? So Absolutely. Fun. That's the main thing. And if you guys have been enjoying Game Arg over the last year, why don't you tell us what you've liked? What have, what shows have you enjoyed? What games did you enjoy? Yeah. What was your favourite Game Hog moment of the first year of us being on YouTube? Where do you want to see us go from here? Where do you want to go from here? Well, you know, I think we just keep doing what we're doing, but bigger, better, more... Uh... Erect. Yeah. Yeah. All yeah. those things. We've got more sketch ideas coming soon. Yeah. Uh, one which we're really excited for that might hopefully take off if we manage to deliver it well. Uh, there's a little a little preview there. It's called In Therapy. <laughs> yeah, but I think my favourite moment, to be honest, was at MCM in October, just being on stage again. And when we first did MCM, we had just a tiny audience. No one was really there, just our mates. And then the next time, it was full. It was it so was. many people, and they were all cheering and laughing. And at the end, with that big group hug. And it just, it, I felt like a rock star for the first yeah. time in my life. Absolutely. And yeah. then we met um, Alex as well, our yeah. biggest fan, CSGO Co. That and meant the world to us. That was just a huge yeah. moment. So it's basically, it's been a real roller coaster year. Yeah. Admittedly, we reached the 10K mark. That for us was huge. Obviously, over the last couple of months, we've dropped and we don't know why. Yeah. It's annoying. We still lose and gain subs every day, but I mean, yeah, we'll figure it, it out. Some changes to YouTube, some. Say it's like on I don't know, but you know, we're just we're gonna we're not gonna stop. We're gonna keep doing what we're doing, and uh, yeah, keep entertaining you guys. Keep entertaining you guys for years to come. If Indeed. I did say it correctly. <laughs> anyway, guys, sorry that this has been a slightly self-indulgent video for us going through everything that we've done, but hey, we've been doing this for 365 days now, so we wanted to see Yay. how far we've come and what we've made, and pretty much a video a day for that whole time. God, I'm tired. You yeah, so am I. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching, and thank you for sticking around. We'll see you in the next video and every video for next year to come. Take care, guys. Bye,